looking very dapper. 50 pence, one pound, two pounds 50. You see, if you've got the eye and access to all the right car boot sales, you can dress like Prince Philip for under a fiver. <laughs> I thought you went car booting to sell stuff, not buy it. Well, there's often a lull in the proceedings, and if I dress like this when I'm selling, it can make my merchandise much more appealing. You sell bits of old lawnmower and football programmes. You don't sell the steak, you sell the sizzle. Thank you, Tommy. You see, he gets it. And it's just as well I'm dressing like this, because at my most recent sale, I met a rather attractive lady. Yeah, she was after a cable for an obsolete printer. I'm strategy, sir. Mm. Well, I don't know much about computers, but I might have something in here. Uh, how about this? This is it exactly. 16 pins, perfect. How much did you say it was? I didn't. I suppose it's just a question of uh, how much you're prepared to spend, Mrs... Uh... It's Miss. Is it? Well, in that case, you just saved yourself 75 pence. <laughs> well, Jim, there's not many women could resist that. You sly old dog. So how much did you charge you for the cable? Well, it's irrelevant now. We're going out on a date. Come on. One pound fifty. <laughs> <laughs> well, I couldn't give it to her, could I? She'd feel beholden. I could have got three quid for it if I wanted. Mm, <laughs> someone's in love. Well, I'm pleased for you, Jim. About time you met someone nice. Yeah. She's coming round in a minute. What from? The chloroform? Round here! <laughs> Thought you'd uh, like to meet her, see what you think. I haven't had many friends since Mum died. She won't replace us, will she, Daddy? 